Hey everyone, TechnoMint here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your iMessage notification not showing on your iPhone. So you're going to follow these steps if you're having issues with iMessage or your text message not showing up on your phone. So let's get started. The very first thing you want to check out is that your phone is not in Do Not Disturb. You can pull down the control menu or pull it up and then check out the focus here. Once you tap and hold on it, menu like this will pop up. You want to ensure that if it's on, you need to click on it so that it is turned off. We don't want the do not disturb to basically prevent us from getting any notification. Now, the next thing you want to do is go ahead and check in the settings that your notification is actually turned on. So go into settings, go to notification. Now you're going to go down here for messages and you want to click on allow notification and then also want to make sure these are selected to be on and then lock screen notification banner and the notification center all of these should be already turned on and then you can also have these optional settings as on well. and if you want to show it in the lock screen go ahead and make sure this is always turned on to be always so that it can show up on the lock screen notification as well so you want to make sure these settings are turned on just like i have here so you can get those messages notification in case they got turned off by any accidental reason now another thing you want to do is that if your messages app is uh, on just simply close it out and then relaunch it so if it's frozen or stuck or causing any issues it will fix the notifications as well now along with that the next thing you want to go ahead and do is set the notification sound to make sure that is on so in this time we're going to go back to settings but this time we're going to go to sounds and haptics and from there on you want to click on where it says text tone right this option if you want the notification try a different text tone so if you had one default, which is this one, it's not working. If it's selected to none, you won't get any notification. So you want to make sure this is one of these are turned on or to make sure that you select another one if the one that you have isn't working for you. The next thing you want to also verify is that if you're not getting notification, especially from a specific person, right, you want to check that their contact is not muted. So in order to check that, open up your iMessage like I did, click on their message, tap on their name, and right here it says hide alert if this is turned on you'll not get any of their notifications so we need to make sure that this setting is turned off just like that and once that's turned off you can verify that they're not unmuted accidentally now the next thing you also want to check out is that the person maybe someone that you're looking to get text message is not blocked accidentally in the settings here you want to go into your phone here and then click on phone this time and then from there on block contact you're going to click on that and then from there on you're going to look at the list to make sure their number is not blocked and if it is you want to just simply unblock them under this contact or block list now the next thing you want to do if you're still having issues simply force restarting your iphone now in order to do that you're going to want to press and release the volume up press and release the volume down one after another and then hold on to this side button just like I am here and we're going to wait for the phone to go completely black where it says slide to power off do not need to touch that just keep on holding that side button and we're going to wait for the Apple logo to appear and that is basically shutting down the phone software and reloading the code to make sure that if it's a software related issue it is fixed again make sure you press volume up volume down one after another quickly before holding on to that side button you may need to do it a few times to get the hang of it if it doesn't work the first time and this is known as a force restart it will not delete any of your personal data so all of your photos videos apps will be safe on your iphone now the next thing you also want to check out is that if you're connected to a bluetooth device especially if you're connected to a car play or another external uh, device it might be sending those notifications there and in order to make sure that it's not sending it there you can turn off your bluetooth completely and check to see if you're getting your iMessage notifications on and if you are that most likely the cause would be that device getting those notifications you can always click on the eye icon to remove that device as well and disconnect from it now the next thing you want to do in your settings is verify under your settings messages that you want to go ahead and see where it says mentions which is notify me make sure that is turned on as well and that will make sure that you get notification if someone mentions you in their conversation if you're not getting those notifications that you're looking to get as well so there's other things to check out and 
Along with that is if you have uh, in your settings, if you have text message forwarding, I don't have it here, but if you have a text message forwarding option here, you also need to turn that off. Make sure it's not turned on accidentally. Here I don't have it just because this phone is in, doesn't have that, but in scenarios you do, you want to turn that setting off as well. And after doing all that, the next thing you want to do is go ahead and update your phone's, of course, uh, software. If you're still getting issues in the settings here, you're going to go to uh, settings general and then click on software update and if there's an update out go ahead and update your phone give yourself half an hour to 45 minutes and once your phone has been updated it should be again working if it's a software related issue impacting your iPhone and I hope going through these troubleshooting stuff help your iMessage notification working again if so please consider the like and subscribe button also share with us if you found a better way or found another issue that you that solved iMessage notification working again in the comment section and thanks for watching guys see you guys next time